What's up, YouTube? Today we got something special for you. They're gonna do an Olympic Jordan jersey slash sneaker collection. And uh, I'm excited to go through this with you guys today. Matter of fact, I was looking on YouTube for a couple of uh, Olympic jerseys. They're not a lot out there. So I'm gonna try my best to give you guys some decent content, maybe some things you haven't seen before. And uh, let's get rolling. Today we got on the 1996 jersey. I do have some Gatorade Sixes on today, and uh, that's that. Let's get right into it. First, we're going to start off with the 1984 series. And as you see here, we have the red 1984 alternate jersey. We do have the stitching on the number nine in the USA. What I love about these jerseys is on the inside, you do see the actual scores of the game in which USA won. And on the back, you have your regular number nine, MJ. And the jock tag is really, really cool. So that is the red alternate jersey. Coming up next. Now, fun fact, he did play with Patrick Ewing in the 1984 Olympics. And they pretty much dominated. This is the blue version. Again, Nike made. And beautiful. Now, the next jersey we got, I will say I haven't seen it before. I was doing some research and I came across it. This is a 1984 reversible Olympic jersey in one side. And then the other side... We do have his college jersey. So I'm going to show you guys that real quick. And this is pretty much the same style that MJ wore. You do have the North Carolina with the jump man. And check out this jock tag, guys pretty cool so we're gonna swing right back to the number nine and the number nine has some interesting stuff on it you see as it says champion UNC some of his totals pretty cool man so I'm glad I got that in the collection. <laughs> the camera is strong. So next up, we're gonna go to 1992. This is actually an original 1992 jersey. It was made by Champion back then. Um, this is what most people uh, wore back then. Um, these these very uh, thin Champion jer Champion jerseys, and in fact, some of them are, are popular to this day. Um, I believe Drake wore a gold version, and uh, all of a sudden that became popular. And then second, we have the 1992 warm-up. We have the Jordan nameplate stitched. We have the number nine stitched. Shout out to my son making all the noises. And we have the USA basketball beautifully stitched. These are very heavy. And we have the same jock tag as we have on the 84 and the 92 series. And moving on, we had the 2012 Olympic jersey. Now this stands for Chuck Daly. He was the 1992 Olympic coach, dream team coach. So just showing, paying his respects. Now, listen guys, this is dry fit. If Nike can make jerseys like this nowadays where the stitching is on point and you just throw it on a dry fit material, it'd be so nice, man. Look at the back here. Let me take a look at the jock tag here. Love this jersey. It's pretty cool. Last but not least, my favorite jerseys. So before we get into these jerseys, I do want to take a look into some of the USA theme and USA colorways um, that Mike and, and MJ and the Jordan brand brought out. 
we do have some gems here. We have the 2004 Olympic 7. We have the 2012 Olympic 6. This is very similar to what Ray Allen wore in the 2000s Olympic Games, except his had the blue here. We do have the Olympic 5 with the 23 stitched. What I do like about these, and eventually they will yellow, is you have a patent leather toe. And you have a patent leather mudguard on the back. Beautiful kick. Now this isn't an Olympic themed sneaker, but this was an East Coast sneaker that Jason Kidd wore. I did decide to put it in the video because it does have the same colors as some of the other Olympic sneakers that we have here. This is the latest version of the Olympic shoe 2012 beautiful and last but not least we do have the tinker alternate i wish the blue was a little bit more navy as the originals were and i think that would have been more interesting tinker made a sketch and this was this is what could have been the olympic the first olympic shoe that mj would have worn in 1992 all right now we're going to get to my two favorite jerseys are the Navy 1992 version of the Olympic jersey. This is the away. And then we have the home version of the 1992 jersey. These jerseys were really well made, really heavy and i'm really happy to have them and that is that guys i hope you guys enjoyed the video let me know if you guys want to see more content like this um i don't have a lot of time but when i do i try to make it up for you guys and try to give you videos such as these there's not a lot of youtube videos about jordan jerseys so i was just happy to bring this content to you guys if you guys have any ideas down below, let me know and uh, give me a shout. All right? Later. Peace. Yurt.